after spending 37 of my 45 years as a journalist here in San Diego, I've seen this happen way too often. Hit and run drivers. I've seen many families' lives changed forever, whether it's the victims or the criminals. There's many reasons why people do a hit and run. No license, no insurance, possibly a stolen car, or even a DUI. They know if they hit and run, chances are the penalties are gonna be much more lenient than that of a DUI. So how can we get these to stop being so prevalent? Number one, and probably the only way, is to change the laws. Think about it. It's less of a penalty to hit and run than it is to get a DUI. This has got to change. Make the penalty four times stiffer for a hit and run driver than it is for a DUI driver. Maybe this will curb the cowardly actions of these criminals. In a recent case where a driver crossed the double yellow line and hit and killed someone and then left, his penalty? Well, let me read it to you, quote, felony hit and run causing death and or permanent serious injury, end quote. The penalty carries one to four years and up to $10,000 fine. And that's only if he's found guilty. What deterrent is that? This is unacceptable. It's time for people to give a damn and take the time to email, phone, or write their local congressmen or other elected public servants. Now is the time. Let's do this. For one man's opinion, I'm Rhett Lawrence.